Hello everybody, Video Gamer King here, and welcome back to Echo 2018, The Great Yoke Tales. That glitch has been finally fixed, and I can be able to make videos on this game again. At least I think so. Uh, okay, well. Anyway, so, yeah. In this episode, in the last episode, we explored all the ruins of Wukong, and gotten all the eggs here. In this episode, we're gonna get the treasure egg, and maybe hopefully move on to the next world. So, first, in order to get the treasure egg, we need to get this dynamite, and go into the other room with this guy... Who actually owns the dynamite. And blow this place up. Which is much quieter than the other one. Jeez. And then talk. Thank you for finding my dynamite. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Thank you for finding my dynamite. Oh, no. The door to the treasure... Oh, no. The door to the treasure root chamber is locked. I heard that Chief Decal of the village knows how to open it. That's our clue to talk to Chief Decal. The guy who uh, always says good day to you. You now says something else now. And let's go out here. What the? What the heck? Are there are no eggs? Hold on. What was that? Guys, yeah, did you see that? There's like a egg over here. Uh, well, I have no idea what that was. Oh no, that's that. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. Was. No, uh, whatever, sorry, we're getting off track. That was not expected at all. Anyway, let's just go talk to Chief to call. Greetings, what? Bleh. Greetings, young one. You want to. <sighs> sorry. I got a little bit sick again. You want to know how to get into the grand burial, sh burial chamber, I assume. Getting into the chamber is no easy task. You can only it can only be achieved by the most worthy, <coughs> the most worthy coffer. Because I'm doing that a lot. As a test of your worth, I would like you to wrestle Nimba, our tri no Nimba, Nimba. Sorry, I always used to pronouncing the B in Nimba or something like that. Our tribe's strongest warrior. If you win, I will aid you in your quest. How does that sound? You're on! Yep, we're supposed to correct the, the, we're supposed to press the correct buttons as they appear. Don't worry if he hits you. As long as you press the correct buttons, you'll fine. Be fine. Yeah, see, look at that. This isn't wrestling, I'm just punching him in the same place over and over again. Yep, and we won, just like that. Yep, let's tell Chief to call. Tell Chief to call. That was an impressive match. Congratulations on your victory. There is a key to the Grand burial, burial, burial Chamber, but it was lost centuries ago. Legends say it was that. Uh, legend has it that a worthy he hero can complete a ritual to Kainich Ahu, the god of the sun, bring four fruits to his altar on top of the temple to begin the rich ritual and ask for the key. If Kainich Ahu deems you worthy, he will show you show it in a way that only the gods can. By making an entrance in the tunnel. Now, first fruit, this thing. Forgot what it was, but I heard it tastes disgusting. Second fruit, pineapple. There's some eggs here that I forgot to get. Third fruit, banana. It's all the way over here. <coughs> I am so sorry. Alright, and then the final fruit is over here in this tree. It is a pear. At least I think it's a pear. Then you're supposed to go all the way up here. Just rollin', 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 and got to keep on rollin'. I'm going to collect all these eggs, and now I am ripping off Chicka Conroy. Yep, and something opened up behind the waterfall, which is over here. So that's deja vu. I've just been to the place before. Higher on the streets, and I know it's my time to go. All the way over here, and. Whoop, boop. Whoop, boop. Oh, dang it. I was gonna deja vu all the way over here. And yep, there is a key. And yeah. Now What do you think this key unlocks? Treasure? Definitely. Some sort of ancient boss battle? Maybe. But definitely treasure. So this is that's where the treasure egg is. Uh gonna go over here. Yep. So basically you're supposed to go into here. And I'm Batman TB. 
Kind of like how there's like random, like that's the that's the thing about Roblox. Some random things can happen. Seriously, so what was with that egg? That scared the crap out of me. Like I thought. That... Oh come on! Oh well, I'm just gonna wait until the boss battle is done. See you guys then. Just a quick update right here. Um, I actually uh, watched a video on the Skeleton King boss fight. Yes, it is actually the Skeleton King boss fight from my video, of course. And uh, I saw that there is an update where there is a thing in the ceiling that shoots arrows at you. I really hope that's not the case because that would make the boss fight a pain. Albeit it would like make the boss like an actual challenge, but still. Like, something like f constantly firing arrows at you from the thing. You saw that in when I was battling the Skeleton King, you have to stand still in order to, like, hit him. So having to move around, like, all around him would be, like, a chore to do. But yeah. Don't even know why they do this anymore. Like, you're, you guys remember in Egg Hunt 2017, where there was a mummy boss that you had... Like, at the beginning, it was like, cr that door was crowded with people trying to get that egg. And the boss fight would last for that, like, amount of time, like, three minutes or something like that. And the boss fight wasn't even that good. Like, it's on my top ten worst bosses. Like, you have to, like, trap them with colored flames, etc. And then you only have, like, five seconds to get the egg before he comes free and attacks you. And it can be really cheap sometimes. Etc, etc. Yeah, they didn't learn from that. Like, eventually they made it so that everyone can go in that, that room. But with floating torches and etc. Why couldn't they just do it with here? Where they could, like, make it so that... I, I, I met an admin, and he said that they did it on purpose just to annoy people or something like that. But I don't think that's true. Anyway. It should be around the time where the guy would uh, finish the boss fight. I wanted to do that rant real quick just to pass the time. And I'm not going to cut away. Uh, let's see, something else to talk about. Yeah, that cutaway was just uh, useless. Anyway, okay, 59, 58 seconds. I actually uh, did, like, back then before an update came out, the Skeleton King, like, they used, the Skeletons and the King used to lag a little bit, and so I, it would take me more, it took me more than five minutes to uh, beat the Skeleton King. And, uh, the timer didn't run out. But, uh, let me keep battling the Skeleton King, and, yeah. This guy isn't done yet. I can hear him, he's used, swinging his sword thing. I wonder what's taking him so long. <coughs> you got 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, Diaz, I... Nueve, ocho, seis, cinco, cuatro, tres, dos, uno. Your time is up. Let's go inside. Yep. Here he is, the Skeleton King. Let's see, is it true? No, it is not. Aw, oh, man, they got rid of the boss fight music. It was like... Uh. Oh, okay. Man, you, you heard the boss fight. You said it was like, woo, go. But now it's just the generic music. And the skeletons are glitched. Oh, please don't tell me this boss fight is glitched. Oh, no, no, here we go. And the skeleton is stuck in fight. This boss fight is kind of glitched. Or not, maybe. Nah, never mind. Man, they got rid of- Oh crap, that's a lot of skeletons. Oh, there's the king. Okay, attack the king. Yeah, once you, like, get- Once you, uh, defeat enough skeletons, the king will come down, and etc, etc. You saw the video. Maybe. Let's check out the treasure. Uh, okay, that's new. Oh, well, that's a skeleton. Okay. I just want to check out the treasure real quick while the low skeletons are falling down. Uh, what's this thing? Uh, some sort of statue? I don't know. <coughs> Man, 
Man, 15 doesn't really know how to make a boss fight, do they? Like, the first time I faced the Skeleton King, it was just a okay. But, not now. Get down here, you stupid skeletons! Okay, I see why this guy was taking uh, forever to uh, do it. Get down here, you stupid king. Uh. Hello? King? Are you gonna come down here? That's it, I'm coming up there. Come on! Oh, whatever. Oh, oh, the skeletons are down. Get down here! Thank you! Let's quickly defeat you, this form. Come on, get defeated, get defeated! Quickly! Come on, the time will run out! Now you stupid skeletons, do not... We need to hurry up. Because apparently they fixed the glitch with the timer. But they did not fix the glitch with the skeletons. Ah, Christ, they're lagging again! No! Please, Lord above! I just took a really bit. I took a really, uh. hard math EOC today. Please don't do this to me. Please, Lord, have mercy on my soul. Yes, I'm a Christian. And do not hate me for that. Or I will do something. I don't know. Social justice. Come on. I have 56 seconds left. Come on. Get down here. I'm not going to be able to do this, am I? Oh, wait. Hold on. No, here's a skeleton. Where were you? Come on. Get down here! Please. Oh, come on, I could've been... Oh, I got him here! Man, I know I can get up here, though. I know I can get up here. Up. Uh, the okay. The did I break the game? I broke the game. I am now officially a Markiplier clone. I stole his outro, and, well, I don't swear, and my content's family friendly. Uh, oh, oh, come on! Okay, let me try and get up, okay, I got up through here. At least I get extra time, because I broke the game. Bear with me here, guys. I am pressing shift to do the dive. I am pressing shift. Oh, now you come down. Oh, don't you make me go oof. I'll oof you. Die, stupid, idiot, friggin' mother, friggin' hugger, motherfucker, friggin' hugger.
And you're dead! Treasure Egg of the Jungle Temple. S forget you, bro S Skip you, Booker. We got the Treasure Egg. Oh, okay. We are done with the Ruins of Wukong. Hopefully 15 actually notices that uh, glitch and uh, fixes it. Anyway, <coughs> we still got some time left, so let's go to the Under Nest. Why was the cook arrested? He was caught beating an egg. That's dark. Real dark. Thanks for the dark humor. Anyways, if it'll load... Welcome, guys, to the final world in the game. If it'll... The Under Nest. This is the most creepy- this is the creepiest world in the game. But first of all, there is the radio egg. Which is just, literally just right out here, out in the open. It'll be hidden around the starter area. It could be like up in here, like it could be anywhere, but- Or it could be over there. Anyways, let's talk to the locals here. Amor has enslaved me and many other innocent people in these mines- oh. Oh jeez. Well, at least we know that Amor is like an actual legitimate villain. Did they update this game so that the radio egg is more common? Cause there, I have not seen more than one uh, radio egg. In what? The whooshing sound for the thing is gone. At least on my end. I hate spiders. On occasion, people will try to run across the giant spider webs over there as a game. Most don't make it back alive. I don't see the appeal in risking death by giant spider for a little rush or a stupid egg. A stupid egg, you say? I could risk a life just to get an egg. Yep, we have a mini game up ahead. Have you ever heard of like Cave Rush or something like that? This is kind of like this. But I like the music here. I just love the music for some reason. Like, I don't know, I just, like, xylophones, like, I kind of like xylophones for some reason. Probably because I had one as a child and always played it. I don't know. What the? Yeah, that's the bad thing about this game, is that sometimes you don't see the, uh, little crevices. You can jump and the duck, uh, you know. Well, hold on, you can use Y or the arrow keys to go up, down, jump, or duck. I use the arrow keys because it's easier to use. And plus how my character is running, it's just like, oh gosh, there's a giant spider like chasing me or something. Ooh, that was close. Oh, that was close. Ooh, that was close. I dare someone to just, like, stay in the middle the entire time, but I don't think that's actually physically possible. Trust me, I tried. But if someone can do it, I'd like to see a try. I think it's easier to just move left and right. We're almost there. Just no more cheap shots. Ooh, okay, that was close. We made it. And, oh, yes, Kenneth is doing the game, too. We get the spider egg. <coughs> Even though we can't see it, and a cough. Let's see what it looks like. Yep, looks like that. Anyway, let's reset real quick. Nope, I think it's still in the back. Anyway, there is another thing right here, which is a ladder. And... If you climb all the way up it, there's another guy. We've got all these awesome zip lines strung up across the entire undernest. They seem like a lot of fun, but nobody's brave enough to try it out. Come to think of it, I can't even think of what ha what I can't think of what what's at the end of the zip lines. Huh. 
Weird. Anyways, what us? Uh, oh, and by the way, uh, all right. I think I explained this earlier, but yeah. Basically, if you take the zip lines, you'll <coughs> uh, go get an egg, as you know. But I don't know why anyone would actually try out know, zip lines. I mean, the zip lines right here would actually pretty much hurt your hands like a lot. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, sometimes it's best to use your umbrella power up. To instead of the zip lines, yeah, right, right there. Yeah, use the umbrella power up. It's way easier, and you can. It's kind of cheap, I'll admit. But uh, okay. All right, there's the egg right over there. Let's take the zip line because you have to. And we get Newton's third law of eggs. For every uh, action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. All right, we're close to getting all the eggs in the in the game. But let's go back to the start and let's take this direct route. Stick to the right because no, it's not up there. Uh, is it over here? Uh, no, 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 no. It's over here. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to find my way around here because you can get lost easily in here. Oh yeah, another right here. I'm so hungry. Not a lot of food makes its way down here, but when the skeleton birds do bring food, it's nothing good. Celery, onions. The pizza lunch bowls that require a microwave. How could they do this to us? At least it's something, dude. Like, I mean, if I was literally, like, captured by some evil bird and they brought me, like, really bad food that I would normally not like, but probably eat if I was really desperate, I would probably eat them. Uh. Uh, this up here is where you can go to the final boss. Are you the bird? Nope. There is a skeleton bird that you can talk to. I have no idea where. Oh wait, hold on! No, 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 no. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let's reset. Yeah, I know where it is. Okay. So you go over here, but instead you go jump down and. Yeah, this is it. This is it. A skeleton bird would talk to you. You see, there's an A in this cage. This bird will tell you all about it. Kaka, ka, kaka, 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 ka. Gesture at the egg of the bone cage, and then to the hole in the ground next to it. Kaka. Go suicide. Okay. Grab the crystal and take it with you. Don't drop it. Okay. And it's another mini game that you have to use cannons for. And hold on, I'm actually gonna try and concentrate. Fart! Oh, thank goodness! All right, let me try and concentrate real here. Basically, you're supposed to rush to the end with the crystal. Frick! Let's try this again. I mean, yeah, yeah, they're on the time limit. There's a badge if you beat it like in under like 20 seconds or something. Alright. There we go. Oh, no, not yet. Okay. Yes, the Egg of Dark Nest. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, that fills up that entire page. Uh, yeah. Uh, wait, hold on. There's one final egg we can get before we beat the final boss. And that is if you go over here. Wait, hold on. Did we talk to you? This guy? No, we didn't. The skeleton birds watch over us as we, as we work and in our free time. If anyone looks suspicious, they report directly to Lord Amor. Just try not to make eye contact with them. 
Man, this place is really creepy. Uh, ah, oh, crap, I'm lost. Okay, hold on, no. But yeah, we stick to a right. I'm not doing anything suspicious. I'm just a worker trying to find his way to a place. A mini game place. A book teleport place. That's over somewhere. I already talked to you. Ah, here it is. Alright. The final mini game. Blizzard Valley. Yes. Let's hatch a plan to get that next egg. I don't really have a plan for the next egg, except... Well, actually, yeah, I do. I'll tell you later, but yeah. <coughs> Can't see it right now, but I'm dancing. Blizzard Valley. Pretty... You go from, like, a really creep and creepy and dark place to just... Cheerion. Is that... Is that, is that like... Scrooge from... I don't know. Yeah. What do you sound like again? Welcome to my... No. Welcome to... No, I can't do it. Welcome to my workshop. Oh, there we go. In an effort to right my wrongs, I am delivering presents to all the good boys and girls. However, I'm running behind schedule. Could you help me deliver presents? Absolutely. I mean, oh yay! Yes. Or <coughs> whatever. Too hard to like. Great. Hop onto the back of the sled and be in the present launcher. To th oh great! Now he sounds like a cold server dude. On the twenty-eighth turret, she presses to all twelve houses, and I'll give you a reward. But first, there there is a bunch of gold eggs around here, and oh well, there's a reindeer, and there's some robots we can talk to. Vixen. Beep boop beep. Happy holidays! Yep, there's robots named after the, the reindeers of Santa. I don't even know all the names except for. Well, I know Rudolph, but yeah. Oh, well, there's. Dasher. Beep beep beep. Shifting into maximum overdrive! Uh, yeah, and which one are you? I'm gonna guess Comet. Oh, I was right! I did not. I did not actually know that. Boop boop beep. Welcome to Screw Death Workshop. We can't go outside. We can't explore Wizard Valley. Anyway, so basically, you're supposed to interact with this, and then a shooting mini game appears. And then basically, yeah. You have to shoot presents at everything. But here's my strategy. Unload! Like, just shoot randomly! Eventually, you'll... get it into... Okay, you don't shoot randomly randomly, but you get the... Th you get the gist. Do that. Yeah, and eventually you'll get it. Uh, okay. Of course, there's a badge to if you complete the mini game without missing a shot, but you obviously cannot do that. Like, it is impossible, at least for me. And we did it. The prez egg. That was easy. Oh, yeah, he says the same thing. Yeah, maybe later. Okay. Yeah, let's go back to the Undernest. This world, this world egg has, the word egg has no anagrams, unlike many other words. I don't even know what an anagram is, actually. Guilty as charged. A shiny female Eevee. Boy, that's like something every Pokemon trainer would love to have. I'm actually really into Pokemon, by the way. I even have my own team with the nicknames and Pokemon and everything. I may actually do an, uh, a video about Pokemon Showdown, if you guys want to do that. 
Come down, comment down below if you want me to do, to uh, uh, play Pokemon Showdown. Anyway, if we go up here, this is where we put all the treasured eggs, and that'll open up, uh, excuse me, the book to the final boss. But of course, there's a shield over here. Let me go fight Anger. Fight Anger. But yeah. In the next video, we will put all the treasure eggs into their places and defeat Lord Amor for the finale. See you guys then.